welcome to my channel. This is Bentley, if you are new here. <laughs> Today, I'm gonna share with you guys some of my favorites for your home slash apartment. Just some stuff that I have been loving in my apartment and I wanna share with you guys. I just moved into my new place almost a month ago now. It'll be a month in like a week and a half, I think. I moved in on the 28th of last month, so we're still getting settled. I'm still reminding myself of that, but I figured I'd share with you guys some of the items that I've been loving, and I will have everything linked down below. If you guys are new, please make sure to subscribe, leave a thumbs up if you guys enjoy the video, and today's video is also a collaboration with my good friend Nastasia. We've been collabing on Amazon videos for years it feels like now she's amazing she's got a ton of home and lifestyle content diy kind of stuff makeovers all those fun kind of things over on her channel so if you guys have not checked out her channel definitely go check her out she's amazing i love her i will have her channel and her instagram linked down below if you guys want to go check her out she is sharing a bunch of her amazon favorites over there as well let's go ahead hop into this I have a list written out somewhere of the items that I wanted to remember to share with you guys. So I'm gonna find that list and let's get into this. All right, since we are at my coffee table, this is one item that has kind of become a coffee table book. Um, and it's something that I will pick up every single morning, every single night, and I will just read through one of the essays. So everything is just kind of like divided out. And they're really easy reads, only a few pages each but this is something that I love having out. Also, it's an aesthetic book to keep out on your coffee table, uh, but just like the essays inside are really, really good. Highly recommend checking this out, man. It's a good read so far. I think I've read about 10 of the essays so far and I'm thoroughly enjoying them. So highly recommend checking this out. If you guys are new here and didn't know, I am obsessed with plants. I am a plant mom. Let me just quickly show you guys the amount of plants that I have in here. And it continues into the office, into my bedroom. We've got plants all over the kitchen as well. So I always get questions about my plants and where I find the pots. So let me show you guys some of my favorite pots for your plants from Amazon. All right, first up we have this one. It's kind of a cool design. It's got like a face in every direction. I really like it. It comes in a set of two, so I just have my pothos in that one. And then I have this little baby in this one. I love these, they're so cute. They're also perfect for flowers. If you wanna do like a flower display, little vase of flowers on your counter, so cute, love them. All right, next up we have this little Easter Island head. I get a lot of questions about this one. I love this one. I have my snake plants in it currently. It is a very deep pot. So I threw in some um, like plastic or tissue paper, whatever I could find in there because I used to have like smaller um, pots in there of plants, but that one fits for now. But I love this little dude, so cute. Goes with the cement concrete kind of vibe that you guys can see I have going on in my apartment. All right, moving into the bedroom and my unmade bed, I just totally ran into the wall as well. Just giving you guys real life here. This is, this is what it is. But one thing that I wanna point out are these concrete trays. I love them so, so much. Uh, I, excuse me. <laughs> I have two of them in my bedroom on my nightstands, but they would be perfect on like a kitchen countertop or guest bath, anything like that, just to kind of display some items like I have here. So I have one on this side of my nightstand and then I have the other one hanging out over here on this nightstand and I love them. I love the like cohesive look of having them on my nightstands. Very, very cute. They just look so fancy. All right, this was another recent purchase of mine. Don't mind my tags from the, uh, the hoodie that I put on this morning. But this was another recent purchase of mine. This was like a birthday present to myself. I really wanted a good speaker to have in my apartment. I personally love this brand. The speakers just sound really, really nice. And this one actually has um, I'm not gonna say her name, but it works with Amazon, you guys already know. So it's really nice because I just recently discovered that you can connect this with your uh, Echo Shows. I have three of those things, I love them so much. And you can play your music 
collectively through all of the speakers that you have. So now I don't need this one in my bathroom with here, with this one. Um, I'm gonna put this back out in my kitchen or I can move it to my office, but I love it so much. I love that it has the feature that those have as well because I use I use my my Amazon gal quite often to help with like timers, telling me the weather, stuff like that. It's just really nice to have. And I love that it's built into these speakers now. I think it's a really cool feature. I highly recommend checking it out if you want to like splurge on a fun speaker. The sound quality is amazing. So crisp, so good. I love it. All right, next up, we have some of my favorite books from Amazon. These I have yet to find a place for. They will probably end up in my office once I get like another dresser in there. But I love these books so much. You guys would have seen these in my last apartment. They make such cute coffee table books. If you guys are into astrology and you're very you're a very spiritual person, these books, they're amazing. Very cute and obviously lots of, oh, excuse me. <laughs> lots of good content in here. I really love all of the stuff that they've got. Just so fun to look through as like a fun coffee table book. Like I said, I'm probably gonna put these in my office. Um, so I have the astrology, I have the tarot book as well. I love this one, this one's really, really cool. Ironic of me to pull it open to this page. <laughs> if you guys are good at reading tarot cards, you know anything about tarot. I am internally laughing at this. <laughs> but anyways, lots of good info in this book as well. And again, just makes like a really cute, fun coffee table book. The last one that I have is the Book of Symbols. You guys can see my tarot card and oracle deck collection is just continuously growing. I love them so much. Um, I also have this one. This is the Book of Symbols. And if there is ever a symbol of something, you see things for a reason. So if there's ever a symbol of something and you are curious what it means, this book has them all. I love it. So cool. Again, lots of knowledge, good information in these, and they're just really cute to have out as well. So, love these, highly recommend, super cute. Love having them in my apartment. All right, so now moving into my kitchen, we've got some of my favorite essentials to have in your kitchen. First up, we have my Yeti cup. I think I've shared this in a few Amazon videos by now, but I love this thing so much. I literally will take this thing with me everywhere, and I love that it fits in your cup holder. For me, that's it. It's amazing, love it. I used to be like all about my hydro flask, but that thing just does not fit in my cup holder in my car. It's too bulky. It makes a lot of noise when you carry it around. It's like people's emotional support bottle, but this is now mine, love it. This is the Yeti and it keeps your drinks hot or cold, just like the hydro flask ones do. Really amazing. I love the like straw feature lid as well. Really, really helps me drink more water, honestly. Next up, fun thing. If you guys have been watching my vlogs, you would have already seen these cups. They are square cups. I think they're the coolest thing. I think they call them like vases online, but I love them as coffee cups or just like drinking water, kombucha, anything out of them. They're just so fun and fancy and I love it. They're also perfect if you're making like TikTok videos of your coffee or your beverages. The aesthetic, the aesthetic, we live for it, clearly. Love it. Highly recommend these. These are super cute. These would be so fun when you have like guests over and you're, you're making like fun cocktails and such. These would be really cute glasses to like serve them in. So these ones are sold individually. I only have two of them right now. I don't think I'll buy any more, but I love them so much. They're so cute. You can use them as vases or cups, whatever you would like. Another fun glass that I love to have. This is kind of something that I have with one of my best friends. So her and I went to like this restaurant locally in Laguna and they serve like these amazing drinks in these pineapple glasses and her and I have been obsessed with them. So we actually found a set of these on Amazon. It came in a four pack. So she has two and I have two because that way we can always have like pineapple cups at whoever's place that we're at if we want to have like wine like on Valentine's Day. Her and I did like a little Galentine's Day and brought these to the beach and had wine in them and it was just the cutest thing. We made a whole video of it on TikTok again the aesthetic. I love it, but I will sometimes make my iced coffee in these, have my kombucha. They're just like such a fun little glass to have. It's like just something a little different than your usual simple cup, you know? All right, while we are here in 
my kitchen. I also want to share my favorite mugs with you guys because I do get quite a few questions about these. I shared these a while back, maybe in December when I first got them, but these are the glass mugs that I use every single day. I literally had tea in it this morning. I love them so much. They come in a set of four and they also stack, which is really, really nice because I do have quite a few mugs, like fun tourist mugs in my cabinet and they take up quite a bit of space because you can stack them. But I love that like all four of these can stack in a single line and then they like don't take up a lot of space. Plus again, the aesthetic, the glass cup, super cute. They are double uh, walled, which is nice. So you can still hold it without like burning your hands if you want to. Cause I feel like this little handle is a little small, but that's obviously so they can stack nicely with each other. But it is nice that you can like hold the cup and not burn your hand at the same time. All right, I feel like it wouldn't be one of my videos if I didn't mention my Nespresso's. If you guys watch my vlogs, you know I'm absolutely obsessed with Nespresso. I make coffees every single morning. Yes, I have two machines. Some people hate on it, it's fine. I mean, I love, I love each machine for different things. If you guys are new to the Nespresso world, this is the difference between the Virtuo line and the regular line. So the Virtuo line has quite a few machines and it's gonna come with bigger pods. So essentially you can make single shot espressos, you can make um, coffees, like this is a full size coffee. You can also do double shots. These are my favorite of all time for double shots for the Virtuo line. So we have these. Uh, there's just so many different options with those pods, but it like reads the barcode and will sense and figure out whichever size and whichever one it is. And then it will dispense your coffee there. And then this one I love because it has the steam one on it. They are both the Breville brand, which I love. Breville is one of my favorite um, brands for machines. This one has the actual steam wand on it. If you wanna make lattes, cappuccinos, flat whites, anything of that sort. And this one will only do singular pods. So it only takes these small little pods. So that is the biggest difference between Nespresso's. If you are new to it, Virtual Line uses these pods. You've got like eight different cup sizes that you can make for coffees. And then the regular Nespresso machines, you can only do these tiny little espresso pods. So I love both of my machines. This one is definitely pricier, I will say. I had a gift card, which is why I ended up buying it because I loved it. Um, and then this one is definitely more on the affordable side, very reasonable price for Nespresso. It's pretty much the same price as like any other Nespresso machine uh, that they have in like their lineup. So highly recommend if you are looking for some good coffee machines for at home coffees, espressos, anything like that, definitely recommend Nespresso. I've had Nespresso machines for the last three years and I love them so much. I save so much money on coffee because I rarely go out because I love making it at home now. Okay, another thing that I want to share that I feel like I always get questions about is my silverware. I shared this in my last like apartment essentials video that I did when I first moved into my last apartment. Uh, if you guys have been following me since then, thank you. Love you guys. Also, it's super dim in here. Let me turn on these lights. Uh, so I have had this silverware for over six months now and it is not tarnished, it is not chipped. I accidentally got one stuck in the garbage disposal without realizing it and like turned it on and so yeah it totally chipped and took off like the black coloring but other than that I had to toss that one because that was not safe to use. <laughs> other than that uh, these have held up very well. I love them so much. I ordered two sets of them. They're very like heavy, good quality silverware, and I love them. Highly recommend if you guys are into the aesthetic look and you want some aesthetic looking silverware. That, that is it. All right guys, I think that is gonna be all of the items that I have to share with you for today's video. Just wanted to share some of my favorite essentials that I've been loving that you guys see me use pretty much every single day in all my vlogs and such. So definitely make sure to subscribe. Check out Nostalgia's channel as well if you guys are new and have yet to see our stuff. Gently has got an itch. <laughs> uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you. Please leave a thumbs up. Leave some comments down below. Let me know of any other video ideas that you guys want to see. And I'll see you guys in my next video.